Hello from Fire Chemistry, I am CS Tans. I remember C Min Jin. I remember Zhen Zhen Bi Jia Hao Kan. Okay, like start our title number one, chapter one, Redox Equilibria. Or maybe in our textbook they are going to call it as Redox Reactions. Okay, so Equilibria, Ping Jin, Balance, Reaction, Hua Xie Fan Ying. So our main problem from this title will be Redox. Okay. So what is mean by redox equilibria or redox reactions? Redox the Hua Xie Fan Ying. So what is mean by redox? Okay. So the words redox they ask in two or three times in the past year, SPM past year, they ask what is mean by redox? Sama jiao redox. So your notes page number one, your cover, need the phone mean sama jiao redox. Your answer, need the tan copy first. Sama jiao redox. Okay, you can pause the video and copy. And now I start. Eh? I assume you finish what you copy, lah. Like, so re redox reaction actually is a reaction that involves the oxidations and also the reductions that occur simultaneously. So some of the redox a reaction is on Hua Xie Fan Ying that involves the oxidations. So Hua Xie Fan Ying, they mean. Your oxidation. So what is mean by oxidation? Yang hua, and also reduction. So what is reductions? If you check dictionary, Chinese dictionary, they call this as what? Huan yuan. That occurs simultaneously. They are occurring So for whatever chemical reactions, when the chemical reaction having these two processes, oxidation, reduction, that occurs simultaneously, we call it as redox. That kind of Huan Xie Fan is called redox. So this is your answer. Next, so what is mean by oxidation? What is mean by reduction? These two points. What is oxidation? What is reduction? A lot of meaning, a lot of meaning. So that's why chapter one actually is quite long, lah. It's a bit long. So oxidation, reductions can be defined in the terms of words. We are having so many meaning of oxidation and reductions, but remember, all the meaning actually they are almost the same. These things are almost the same. So number one. Oxidation reduction normally I just call redox. Ah, we just call it as redox. Can be defined in the terms of what? What is called redox? Number one, loss or gain of oxygen. Lost oxygen, lost oxygen. This is one of the redox. Gain oxygen is oxidation. Lost oxygen is called reduction. But the real example, the main title will be start soon. Now, not now. Now I will give you the basic part. So redox having a lot of meanings. Number one, loss or gain of oxygen. 拿到氧气，不减氧气。Number two, any example of the definition of redox. Redox also mean the loss or gain of hydrogens. Yes, during the chemical reactions, when certain reactant gain the hydrogen, so the hydrogen, another one lost the hydrogen. 另外一个不减 hydrogen. This is also a redox. Okay. And number three, 还有什么意思呢 Redox. In the terms of transfer of electrons, electron transfer during the chemical reaction, one of the reactant lost the electron, that electron put in, tiu tiu, donate. Another reactant gain the electron, so one tiu electron, one so electron. This is a redox. This kind of situation is called redox. What is called redox? Oxidation, reduction occurs simultaneously, simultaneously. Okay, and next, how else? The change in the oxidation number. So, what is change of the oxidation number? When the reactant change in the oxidation number, or what is mean by oxidation number? The charge of the ion, ah, the charge. Okay. Oh, we not start yet. Ah, just basic part. Also, this is also a redox. This kind of term is redox. So, four meaning of redox, and we going to start one by one in detail. We will one by one come. Not for this video. Next video, to start. Okay, I give you the basic first. Four definition of redox: oxygen, hydrogen, electron, oxidation number. Okay, 记住先 Next, 还有什么东西呢 Basic only, page number one. Okay, so for chapter one, we're going to talk about a lot of oxidizing agents. So what is oxidizing agent? Or in Chinese, student tell me, oxidizing agent. It means 氧化剂 Or maybe you're wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. They tell me, "Oxidizing agent." I just hear 
我就写到了氧化剂。So oxidizing agent is a substance that what? 什么叫氧化的 agent 呢 ？OK, oxidizing agent is a substance that oxidizes another substance. 它氧化别人，氧化其他的东西。Or in the chemical reaction itself, 它自己 it will be reduced. 它氧化别人，不过它自己却还原。Okay, so oxidize another substance, or it will be reduced in the reactions. So, 这种就叫 oxidizing agent, 氧化剂，它氧化别人，还原自己。But remember, don't trust my Chinese. 不要相信我讲的话语，我自己发明的。<笑> okay, 这种叫 oxidizing agent 呢，氧化其他的东西。自己切 reduce. Or remember when we talk about agent, 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 the words agent 这个字啊 just can be applied on reactant only. Agent 这个名字只可以用在反应体罢了，反应体才有这个 qualify 称为 agent, agent. So oxidizing agent 那个反应体可以氧化别人 reduce in the reaction 自己切还原。所以这种叫 oxidizing agent 什么来的？ Yeah, the real example will help you to understand. 真正的 example 才会明白。I give you the basic first. Sorry, huh? Very sorry. 等一下。Next, reducing agents. 什么叫 reducing agent? Okay. Or、oh, Chinese, I don't know. 这一次我就不会了。Reducing agent is a reactant. Agent 一定用在反应体的。So reducing agent is a reactant that reduces in the chemical reaction. 它在化学反应里面被 reduce. So read. Ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Reducing agent is a chemical substance. Okay, it's a reactant that reduces another substance. 它还原别的东西 Reduce another substance and itself, 它本身 itself, 它自己啊，又表示代它自己却氧化了 So reducing agent is a reactant that reduces another substance. 它还原别人，不过自己却氧化 Okay, I know you're going to feel having the feeling that blah blah. 晕晕的感觉了 ，and the next example you just follow, follow, follow until you become familiar with all the words like this agent, okay, oxidizing agent, reducing agent. Okay, see you in the next video for more detail. Bye bye.